Hello everyone, so I'm going to be plastering the side to sea side as you can see, absolutely brilliant day here nice views, it's so warm and I'm thinking to myself how do I get out of the van to start to work and testing out my camera soon guys, sorry I got a new camera uh, a present for my birthday a very brilliant present for my birthday and I think I have good quality on this camera but I will let you guys decide so in the inside guys um, all the the damp boast plaster has been removed by the builders and you can see the floors are well covered up here and all the bricks have been treated with uh, been silicone injected I think at the bottom there not too sure as I haven't done it so but yeah that's where we're at guys heavy coat on the walls First job will be a scud coat and then the next job will be a scratch coat and then the next job after that will be a blue coat and then skim coat but I'll show you it as I go through the stages so yeah back to the first room it's about a ton of sand here it should do should do it it's hard to get started with this view outside, but I'm all prepped. Um, so, needed water, guys. No outside water tap. And don't want to be forcing buckets into the sink or spilling water everywhere. This is a tip to use. So, this is it all scratched, guys. Scudded and scratched, sorry. Um, still needs another coat to bring it out nice and flush and level. And um, that's uh, me finished for, the, for this stage just to clean up this stage. But give you guys a, a look at them, them hallway walls there and front porch, sorry, are extremely heavy, so they'll get dabbed the most of them. That's everything well prepped. This is it all now. It's filled out and devil floated ready for skin and I have my beads cut ready to be planted on tomorrow with the finish I show you it here these walls have been dabbed with bonding compound as bonding compound is better for dab issues you don't want to be using just bonding you want bonding compound and as you notice there I also lifted the sheets up off the ground about half inch just to stop any moisture migrating up soaking into the plasterboard and you can see the marks from the float and the beads at the ready for the next morning and you can see the second day at this job wasn't quite so nice a bit miserable but still nice views nevertheless So guys this is it all skimmed out, as you can see a much better day this third day, very bright, very warm, just perfect. And you can see the walls are all skinned in nice and flush, floors are cleaned, mopped, brushed and mopped. So yeah. The walls are ready for now. Once they dry out, they can be painted or repapered as they previously were. So, I think the porch walls came in rather well. Let's see, everything's nice and flush and tidy. Boxes cut out ready for the sockets to be screwed back in. So, yeah. Rim's looking brand new again and you can see this final day sun shining lovely views I should probably just go and land the beach now and rest if you like the video guys thumbs it up help me out and if you haven't already please subscribe for more Mac attacks